y'all. So I just got the shower, you know, got myself together. I'm about to finish my skincare routine before I leave. Y'all know I'm on a CeraVe kick, so we're gonna be using CeraVe products today. This is the resurfacing retinol serum. I'm gonna go in with this first. Then the daily moisturizing lotion for normal to dry skin. Then to top it all off, I'm gonna go in with some sunscreen. I've been wearing sunscreen lately on my face, y'all. My friend told me I should start wearing some, so. I am now, this is the Unseen Sunscreen by Super Goop. I heard that this is really, really good, and I love this, y'all. It's been making my skin really, really glow, and you don't need a lot at all. Like, this has been making my skin look so good. This is definitely a key staple to my skincare routine now, whenever I'm going out during the day. And just like that, ooh, ooh, it's in my eye. And just like that, we are done and the skin is glowing. I hate this freaking bump. I'm starting to think it's an ingrown. I am not entirely sure, but we're going to figure that out later on tonight. When we do this whole uh, self-care night. I'm getting ready to head out soon. I'm gonna actually steam this set before I leave because it got some wrinkles in it and I'm not trying to be out here looking crazy. I don't think I'm gonna put in contact today because quite frankly, I don't feel like it. Alright, so I'm about to head out, but first I need to put on my fragrance. So today I'm gonna be wearing my YSL. This smells so good. I don't know if I bought this on camera with y'all. I don't think I did. I can't even remember when I bought this. Uh, I probably wasn't vlogging, but this is my newest one actually. And it smells so good good it's something really really light i like to wear this if i'm just you know doing stuff around the house or just running errands that's usually what i'll put on <sighs> smells so good um i need to make sure i have everything take my fan because baby it's hot out here today let me give you a little otd it's nothing Spectacular. I have on this two-piece set from Shein. I haven't worn this in a minute, so I decided to pull it out. I'm wearing my off-whites, and then I have on a Gucci bag. And it's like low-key my everyday bag, so let's go ahead and head out. So I'm on the way to Target. I have to turn the AC down so y'all can hear me. I don't want to be, you know, rude and disrespectful and nothing like that. Can we just, like, can we take some time, give a moment of silence for the fact that it is officially... Beyonce album release week. I am so excited this Friday. Her album is coming out and I don't think y'all understand. The amount of screaming that I will be doing is going to be so obnoxious. Like, I'm gonna be so obnoxious when this album comes out. Like I have claimed my tracks already. I'm that girl, alien superstar. I have a few on that list that I'm definitely gonna have to say are my favorites even without me listening because I, I just have the title. It's gonna be my favorite. Since we're on the topic of music, can we also just give a round of applause for my single that came out last Friday. Oh, baby, why, 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 why you play me like you did? So pack your shit and make it quick. I never want to see your face again. Yeah, I want to thank all of y'all from the bottom of my heart for showing me so much love. Y'all yeah, made my very first, like, release very, very memorable. Like, this is something that I will probably never ever forget. It's really doing well. It was number 15 on the Amazon buying charts or whatever. I, I don't know how it goes, but it was number 15. So y'all were running up, running it up on Amazon. The numbers are looking pretty good, not gonna lie. Everything is going as it's planned. So thank you all so much. I really do appreciate it. There is more coming soon. Here's to never be, but I'm at Target right now. About to head in now. I don't know. I'm I'm low-key feeling like I might just do all my shopping here because I have somewhere else to go. I have to drop off a few things at somebody's house. I might just do my shopping here and just say F it. Whatever. I did just get my YouTube check, so <laughs> it's given. YouTube is definitely about to pay for this trip because baby, I don't feel like going nowhere else. <laughs> Down. 
All right, y'all, so I'm back home. Honestly, I ain't even gonna lie to y'all. I spent a little more at Target than I anticipated. So I got some Dove products. I got a, a big old tub of body cleanser. If it wants to focus, yes, yes, yes. I went along and got a few products from their Dove Body Love line. Target didn't have much from this line, so I picked up what I could. This was the body wash that I got, the body cleanser or whatever. Then I got a Moisture Boost Pre-Cleanse Shower Butter. Looks like this. And then I went ahead and bought an exfoliator. This is the crushed macadamia and rice milk exfoliating body polish. Super excited to try this stuff out. Then went along and picked up some tree hut products. I picked up, you know, my holy grails. Okay. Let's let's not act like we don't know what my holy grails are. Y'all know I love, 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 love these. I went and picked up these mighty patch micro point for blemishes. Looks like this. I didn't see the little star pack just so I got these, these are by the brand Hero. So I picked up my regular shaving gel. This is usually what I use. And then I also picked up the Gillette Fusion 5 razors. And I got some makeup wipes because I really need some. I will probably see you guys later on tonight while I go finish cleaning. So until later, I'll see y'all then. <laughs> burn some time while I can so I am gonna stop in Dick's I'm in the parking lot right now I'm about to park I know exactly what I'm coming in here looking for last time I was here I didn't so I was in here longer than I really needed to be in here for but I know exactly what I want I just want to get a black set because I don't have like a decent black set and when I was leaving the gym today one of the workers there she was like you always look so good when you come in here and in my head I'm like child I be thinking I look a mess but I was like thank you thank you girl. I'm gonna go ahead and get me a black um what's it called oh god it's somebody right next to me i now know what it feels like that somebody watch you vlog literally right in the car next to you but um i may or may not get something else but i know i'm definitely getting a black set so let's go So I ended up just getting a gray set and called it a day because they had no black sets in my size. So I just went and got, well not a gray set, I got gray shorts with like a white gym top because uh, the check mark in the gray shorts was white. So I decided to pair the two together. But you could be fashionable with your gym outfits, okay? So I will talk to you guys in a few hours. 
my time, but like one second y'all time. All right, y'all, so I just got out the shower. I'm gonna put on a fragrance of YSL. This is usually what I put on if I'm just chilling around the house. Cause one thing about me, I'm gonna put on a fragrance, okay? That's just, that's just one thing about me. I'm going to wear a fragrance. I don't care if I'm just sitting in the house. I want to show you guys the set that I got from Dix. I know I told y'all what I got, but I want to actually show y'all. I got these gray shorts right here. These are literally like the ones I have in blue. Y'all haven't seen those yet, but I have a pair like these in blue. Y'all know five inch or no inches at all. That is just, it is what it is. If your shorts aren't at least five inches, then what are you doing? Like one thing about me, I'm gonna have on some short shorts, some hoochie daddy shorts. They gotta be at least five inches. I don't want nothing longer. And then I got this, it's a plain white Nike shirt to go with it. I didn't even see this little chevron thing right here. I'll probably wear this tomorrow, honestly. I know I said earlier we were gonna get our feet done today. Well, those plans are canceled. So I'm probably gonna, I know tomorrow, and here he go mowing his lawn. Oh my God. He does this every other day. I know I'm not vlogging tomorrow or Wednesday because I got some business to take care of. Or the household actually has some business to take care of. Thursday, you guys may see me again. I know I'm going out of town this weekend. I may just turn that into its own separate vlog. Or I might actually add this into that one and combine it together so I have more footage. But um, I will see you guys whenever I see y'all because I'm not sure when I'm going to see y'all again. What's good, y'all? So a few days have passed by since the last time I've spoken to y'all. It's currently Thursday, a.k.a. Beyonce Eve. Y'all know Beyonce drops her album tonight at 12 p.m. or 12 a.m. I'm so excited, y'all. It already dropped in like certain areas in the world and people are saying that it hits. So I'm ready, you know. I just got the shout out to long ago. Just finished, you know, getting dressed or whatever. I'll show y'all the OOTD for I go. It's nothing too spectacular because I'm not really doing anything too crazy today. I'm going to get a pedicure with my mother. And then, honestly, I want to go to Ulta. I need to get a new brow pencil. And I low-key want to get a new fragrance too. Might do that today. Might not. I'm not sure. For anything, we definitely, we need to get our feet done. Because mine and her feet look crazy. Like, my big toes, they grow so fast. My toes in general grow really fast but it's something about my big toes they just grow extremely fast and right now like on my shoes I literally feel it at the top of my shoes and that is not a good feeling if you know what I'm talking about I'm gonna take my vitamins because I definitely forgot to take my vitamins today before I went to the gym earlier take out vitamins probably I need to also get some more vitamins but I probably don't want to go back to Atlanta I'm gonna do my hair real quick and then we should be ready to go. I need to figure out who's driving because honestly, <laughs> I just don't feel like driving. I mean, I'll drive if need be. Honestly, I'll probably end up driving because I say I don't feel like driving, but I don't always like being driven around by everybody. And not to say my mother is everybody, but I usually just like to drive myself and call it a day. I don't even know what nail salon we're going to go to today. Might go to the one I usually get my nails done at. If you know, you know, you don't always go to one nail salon for the everything. So most of the time, you know, you go to one nail salon for your nails and then go to another nail salon for your feet, another one for your eyebrows, so forth and so forth. But um, the nail salon that I usually go to, they really do do good feet. We just started going somewhere else that was closer to where we live by. I'm pretty sure. Probably gonna end up going to my nail salon. I don't even think I showed y'all my nails. Hold up. I got pink for um, their Never Be Released. So pink and butterflies. They have like little rhinestones and stuff. It's really, really cute. I'm gonna go put on my shoes and we gonna... Do a little OOTD along with the fragrance of the day because I'm not sure what fragrance I'm gonna wear. I kind of have an idea, but, um, ooh, ooh, but I'm not sure. I don't know. It depends on what vibe I'm trying to go for. So I'm trying to figure out which fragrance I want to wear. It's low key giving a DR Suavage kind of day. Honestly, whenever I wear this fragrance, I get the most compliments on it. Then again, no. I usually like to wear that when like I'm going out out or I'm actually like doing stuff. So I think I'm gonna do my everyday Valentino. Y'all know this is my favorite, favorite, favorite fragrance. It smells so good. It's like the perfect mix of like sweet, but it's also like a, it's not too musky if that makes sense. And here's the OOTD, nothing too much, something slight. It's just a white cut-off sleeve shirt from H&M, Boohoo Man pants, and then I have on some dunks with my tail far bag. Something slight, something slight, because we're not doing much today. Let's go ahead and go get these feet done, child. <laughs>
I'm back home. I want to show y'all what I got from Ulta though. I did go to Ulta and I did get a new fragrance. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. My pedicure was very much needed. My feet feel so much better now. Like, ugh. And I'm going to be real excited to see how my feet feel and everything after I exfoliate with my um, dub exfoliator. But I got two brow pencils because I was running out of the one I have now. Anytime I do my brows, most likely it's Fenty Brows. So I got the Fenty Beauty brow pencil in the color Soft Black. And then when I got the cashier, y'all know how they have like the little knickknacks and stuff right in the front. I saw this mascara and I was like, hmm... I think I'm gonna try it. So this is the Essence Lash Princess. This is a false lash effect mascara. I'm gonna try this out. I'll probably play around with this later on tonight before I wash my face or whatever because I'm not putting nothing on my eyes right now. And now for what you guys are probably waiting for, the fragrance, okay? So this is the Phantom Paco Roban. This is what it looks like. And I was very excited to see how this smells when I'm actually like wearing it out. I was smelling a few fragrances. I was smelling the Versace one. I was smelling this YSL one. I wanna say I smelled the Giorgio Armani one. And I smelled one more. Oh, I smelled um, Burberry Hero, which I know for a fact, that's gonna be my next fragrance. But I'm really, really excited to wear this out. It has like a fresh, like scent and it really smells good it smells really really good it looks like this cute little robot and i love i love i love the way it smells spray it on the box like it smells so good like it smells really fresh all right let's see where can we put mr i forgot what, what is it called paco Roban. Okay, where are we gonna put him at? Let's see. Um, cause I am running out of space. Not gonna lie. I'm gonna put him right here. There we go. Perfect. See, my little collection is starting to grow pretty soon. There's just gonna be fragrances all around. Like, I'm really trying to build up my fragrance collection because I love having like. A variety to choose from because I don't always want to smell like the same thing all the time tomorrow is a chill day I'm just gonna go to the gym and then I have to pack because I'm going out of town I'm going to San Antonio Saturday and then back to the A on Sunday so um yeah Atlanta content coming soon hopefully I am probably gonna talk to y'all a little later on because Beyonce does drop tonight and I think it's safe to say that I need to feel my reaction because come on now let's be real like actually let's talk about this let me put y'all down now so i can really talk about this beyonce is the only artist i kid you not she is the only artist that can make me buy something without totally knowing like what i'm gonna get i bought two pose boxes with no hesitation had no idea what was truly in it no idea what the stuff was gonna look like i just bought it because beyonce was selling it i bought pose box two and four and the poses were released yesterday or the day before i'm not sure and i'm pretty satisfied with what i got i also went and bought a vinyl without knowing what the vinyls are gonna look like none of that i don't even own a record player i still don't really know what the vinyl looks like she might have posted about it did she post about it Cause the last time I checked, she didn't post about it. I know she posted what the CDs are gonna look like. Oh, she did post a vinyl. And I liked it. Ooh, my memory is just really, really bad. Oh, period. Okay. Yeah, so, um, I will probably see you guys later on. I'm about to go eat. My grandma is cooking. And, um, yeah, I'll see y'all later when Renaissance drops. August 2nd, it is 6.23 p.m. I actually just got back to Atlanta, or newsflash, I'm back in Atlanta, if you couldn't tell by 
the scenery. I'm back in Atlanta. I got in like four hours ago. I think we landed around two something. So yeah, about four hours ago I got in. I chilled for a little bit. I kind of unsettled, you know, relaxed. And then I went to the gym. That's what you guys saw before this clip. And now um, I am about to do skincare because I just got out the shower. I need to go ahead and order my food now. I'm gonna get Chiba Hut. I may or may not have talked about Chiba Hut on my channel, but when I was in Vegas, I was eating Chiba Hut a lot. I didn't know they had a Chiba Hut down here. Like, who was gonna tell me that ATL had a Chiba Hut? Let's go ahead and order Chiba Hut. Food is now ordered, y'all. I got, um, well, I'm gonna tell y'all what I got when the food actually comes, but I'm about to wash my face. <laughs> Excuse my bed. I was laying down, but I just got a package. I got two packages actually, and I wanted to open them up on camera for y'all because they're really exciting. At least they're exciting for me. So I wanted to open them up and show y'all the stuff I got. I'm super excited. I have been getting into like the whole production side of music, right? I done, um, bought some stuff like some equipment to get more into producing and i also bought a software i bought logic pro um, i was between logic pro and pro tools i didn't want to use garage band because i wanted something that was just a tap bit more advanced so i went with logic pro because that's what my brother had recommended so first thing i got was um an intercam i want to say it's called um i want to say this is what is used when you're like recording but i'm so upset i wasn't able to pack up the mic that we had at home you know because i was rushing i went to like literally the last minute to start packing oh it's called an interface whatever the scarlet solo third generation two and two out usb audio interface looks like this yeah um it's smaller than I thought it was gonna be. I don't know why I thought it was gonna be bigger. Oh yeah, this is way smaller than what I thought it was gonna be. Literally, I've seen ones that were bigger than this. I'm not sure, maybe it's the one I got. I mean, I'm not complaining at all because this is like very much travel friendly. Like I could put this in like my large travel tail farm. I'm assuming this goes to the guitar if I was to play a guitar. Not quite sure. I'm really, really excited about this package right here. I know exactly what this is. This is a MIDI keyboard. I found out about this on TikTok. This little boy, he had, maybe he had sampled like some Aaliyah song and he was playing it on a MIDI keyboard. I didn't know what it was, but I've always seen like producers use them or whatever. So um, I looked it up cause I thought it was a mini keyboard. I thought they had just, you know, mispronounced it. But no, it's definitely MIDI. So I bought one and I also got a sustain pedal to go with it. I wanted to stick with like the red and black theme. So I got the NPK mini special edition blouse special edition okay this is by akai professional yeah y'all looks like this oh, this is what the back looks like and i'm super 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 excited about this this is the m audio sp2 universal sustain pedal i just got whatever was compatible with this so yeah that's what the sustain pedal looks like oh and it's really really lightweight too i don't know why i thought it was going to be bigger than this but yeah, this is really, really lightweight. And I'm glad I got lightweight stuff because it that means it's gonna be travel friendly. Oh, this is so cool. That is so neat, isn't it? Like, oh my god, I can't wait to stop playing with stuff. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. And then this is the cord it comes with, I'm assuming. So that's the stuff I got. Or whatever. I'm super excited to play with this. I'll probably start playing around with it in a little bit. Will 
Okay. Alright. Bye. What's good y'all? So, this vlog has been all over the place. I apologize. I just, I don't know, I have not been in the vlogging mood. Like, I have not been able to just pick up the camera and I haven't really been doing anything. Like, we've been filming and I've been running around with my mom, so we haven't really done anything. So, this upcoming week, I'm gonna try to start a fresh vlog and try to do some things because I can't keep doing this. I'm getting off my game when literally I just said like a few weeks ago that I was getting back on my game. So, first of all, let's just get into yesterday. I didn't do anything yesterday. Okay, I had two interviews that I did not film. After I opened up my packages channel, I went and I started playing with them. I may or may not play y'all a track that I made. I wrote to it and everything. I just got to finish writing the second verse, but everything else is pretty much already done. If I had a mic here with me, I would start recording the song. Today, Elijah is coming over and we're gonna, you know, make some content and whatever. So I decided why not bring up the vlogging camera because today I'm actually doing something. I'm gonna put on a quick mug i was just admiring my eyebrows because i was looking at old videos of me and my eyebrows were so freaking thick i don't know why they were so thick but they were like atrociously thick then eyebrows suit my face better so i always try to cut them a little thinner because i know once i outline them they always they tend to get just a tad bit wider big eyebrows no that that does not look good on me my eyebrows now versus like the beginning of this vlog most likely you know because i did them like a few days ago they're much thinner now look so much better like can you get into it i'm about to start getting ready i don't really have anything to talk about so i'm just gonna fast forward through this process uh, i have done plenty of get ready with me's on this channel so i'm cool on doing one today <laughs> so um cue the get ready montage i said certified free seven days a week wet ass pussy pick that pull out gate week Woo! It up, nigga, catch a charge, extra large and extra hard. Put this pussy right in your face. Step your nose like a credit card. Hop on the top, I wanna fly. I do a kegel, press the side. I spit in my mouth, look in my eyes. Pussy is wet, it's like a good guy. Time me up, like I'm surprised. That's role play, I wet the skies. I want you to park that big mad truck right in the spirit of a rock. Make it green, make me scream. I don't public, make the scene. I don't cook, I don't clean. But let me tell you, I got this ring. Gobble me, swallow me, drip down the side of me yeah. Jump out for you, let it get inside of me I tell him where to put it, never tell him where I'm about to be I run down on the bar, I have a nigga running me Talk your shit, fight your dip Ask for a call while you ride that dick Really ain't never got him fucking for a thing He already made his mind before he came Now get your boots, hang your coat Fuck this wet ass pussy He bought a phone just for pictures of this wet ass pussy Pay hey, my tuition just to kiss me on this wet ass pussy Now make your brain if you wanna see some wet ass pussy Look, I need a hard hit, I need a deep stroke I need a handy trick, I need a weed smoke Not a car to sneak, I need a king corporate With a hook in me, hopefully oh, he got the No one can judge me but me. I was born free. Hey, 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 you better love. Uh, 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 uh. Woo, woo. All right, y'all. So I am all mugged up. I'm dressed. I'm about to do my hair. My outfit is basic today. I'm wearing all black. This top. It's like a little chest cut out. Uh, this is from ASO. It's like a little baby tee. It's like this little baby tee. And then I have on these pants right here. Y'all have seen I don't know how many times. If we end up going somewhere, like I said earlier, I'm not entirely sure what we're doing today. Uh, I need to line up my mustache because it's a little, little rough looking. But yeah, I'm gonna wear my Prada boots and then I'm gonna, I wanna carry the Prada bag today. Yeah, I'll probably carry the Prada bag with my Prada boots and, um, yeah, call it a day. I am very pleased with the fit. It's so cute. It's like, it's nothing too spectacular, but it's still cute at the same time. I love this shirt. I love the fit of the shirt. Like, I'm getting into those, like, nice cut, uh, like, I don't know, like, really form-fitted shirts. And I love the fact that ASO is getting into, like, the more gender fluid clothes, because a lot of the tops that I have lately are from ASOs. And, you know, literally either or can wear it, men and women. So, yeah. Big kudos to y'all, ASO. Like, I'm gonna take my vitamins. My 
happened a lot. I've not been taking my vitamins lately. Really, really bad considering the climate of the world right now. Monkeypox is spreading and I don't want that, okay? Cold is different because it don't leave scars on your face. I don't need a monkeypox, okay? This right here, this is the money maker. <laughs> Let's pick a fragrance of the day. Um, So it's between Valentino and Dior. I'm not gonna do my John Paul because that's like my workout slash like chill and relaxing fragrance so honestly i think i'm gonna do my swabbage because i have been using this valentino up y'all may not be able to see it but i have put a dent in miss valentino so we're gonna do dior swabbage and one thing about me oh i'm gonna spray a lot of fragrances and i got this little chest out today too so guess what baby one thing about me i'm going to spray a fragrance down okay i'm going to douse myself in a fragrance that's probably why i have so much of a dent in both of these okay because my, my dior is getting a little a little dent in it too but i found out that you can actually refill these i don't know how but you can refill these because it definitely says refillable i have to place myself for the next day because my mother's actually out of town she went to I don't know if she went, but she went somewhere because she had a show. So it's just me today. Can't wait for Elijah to come because I haven't seen her in a minute. So I'm gonna see her today. And then when I come back up here, I'm gonna play around with Miss Logic Pro. But let me take this trash out. I'll see y'all in a bit. All right, y'all, so I'm about to leave, but I'm changing my bag from this Telfar to this Prada bag so I can go with my Prada shoes. Elijah is on her way. I literally just got off the phone with her. So I'm just gonna make sure I have everything in here that I need to have. My wallet, my taser baby. Cause honey, these Atlanta streets is crazy, okay? I'm gonna bring a few masks with me cause monkey pox is real. Lysol. Dang, she here already? Okay, switching my bag out then coming portable charger airpods do i need to take any sunglasses is it sunny outside it's sunny outside um should i do these i think it's giving these oh no i'm gonna do my off whites y'all know i love my off whites and then I'm pretty sure this camera can fit in this bag. Let me just test it to make sure. All right, y'all. So I'm all ready to go. Got the product to match the products, you know. It's giving. So let's go ahead and go downstairs. Guess who I'm with? Hi. So we're at Lennox now. Um, we're going to some cafe. What? Do you know the it's name the of Neiman Marcus Cafe. Oh, the Neiman Marcus Cafe, child. Mm -hmm. I didn't even know they had... It's real okay. cute, real cute. You gonna like it. Mm, I better like it, child. You I know, like I'm in fall. Picky. I look like I'm in the fall. You look cute. Dude, I'm, I'm jelly. I'm, I'm hot. Like I'm pretty hot right now. I like this. You like it? Mm -hmm. Urban Outfitters, babe. Really? <laughs> I like that. I know that's right. Off white socks. The Off white shoes. socks. Okay. Yeah. You know, I see, know. I knew he was gonna wear those. That's why I wore my, my, yes. my shades. <laughs> <laughs> no, for real. Marcus Cafe. Elijah put me on child because I knew nothing of the sort. But it's cute. It is good in there. It's cute in here. I'm here for it. Let's give what it's supposed to give. And they have like food food here. I wasn't expecting them to have like food food. Y'all know me. I'm probably gonna get a burger because who would I be if I didn't get a burger? Come on, let's be real. No, for real, I think I'm gonna get a burger too. But I like the roasted salmon because it's good. But I can't do salmon because I just don't like the smell. You don't like the white smell of salmon. Like, I, if it smells nasty, I cannot eat it. You can't do it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Oh, no, I'm fine. <laughs> okay, so this is brought. Try it. It's good. Well, I'm scared. It's good. I'm proud of you. It's good. Ready? What's yours? Ew. You don't like it? Mm. <laughs> He's sick. <laughs> It it's has like an that. interesting taste. You just don't like chicken broth. Okay. <laughs> All right. I never had it before. Huh? I never had chicken broth. You, you, you ain't never had like chicken noodle soup. Chicken broth is always the base of any See, baby, soup that you have. If it has chicken noodle soup, I must, I have been like nine. 
Like, I, I don't eat chicken noodles. Yeah. <laughs> Y'all, it's a Shirley Temple for me. Y'all know this is literally all I get when I go out. A Shirley Temple. Yeah. Food is served. Yeah, girl, you better say that, Grace. You saw me eat. <laughs> we, both got, fryer too. we both got burgers. Mine has cheese and bacon on it. Should have had pickles, but they want to act like they don't. Hold up. Is that a pickle? Oh, no, I thought this was an onion. She got the same thing. Yeah, we're going to eat and then we're going to walk around for a little bit. So we are leaving Lennox. Lennox. It was good. We bought things. We bought, we bought things. certain trinkets and things. What I bought, and I also went to Urban, but um, yeah. Good shopping day. Very good shopping day. Stupid dog! Alright y'all, so I just got home and um, I am tired. So I'm probably not gonna vlog too long before I end this vlog, y'all. I'm sorry this vlog was literally all over the place. I started it in Virginia. I'm in it in Atlanta, but I promise next week I'm gonna try to make it a little better. But um, I had a good day with Elijah. It was fun and all that. I did get two things. I went to Urban Outfitters and I got this cute top. This reminded me of something Rick Owens would make, right? I got this little, it's like a shredded, Hot to tank top thingy. Then I went to Prada. I just got me a cologne. I saw Prada and I was like, I wonder how the cologne smell. And I've never smelled this cologne before, but it smells really, really good. I never heard of it before. It's called Le Home Prada Milano in Lou, I'm assuming. So yeah, this smells amazing. I am addicted to fragrances at this point. This is what it looks like. It smells so good, y'all. Like. I know I have some fragrance on, but like this smells so good. I'm gonna just end the vlog here because I'm not doing anything for the rest of the day other than playing with my gadgets and stuff like that. So yeah, I hope you guys all enjoyed this vlog, this chaotic vlog at that. Make sure you like this video, subscribe to my channel, follow me on my socials, my Instagram, my Twitter, my TikTok. All that jazz at J Michael and make sure, make sure y'all stream Never Be Y'all. Never Be is out on all streaming platforms. Make sure y'all go stream it, okay? <laughs> all right, y'all, peace. You could me never you be. could never. Never, 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 never.